guys welcome back to my channel and today I'll be doing a book review on the secret cooking club I rate this book five stars out of five stars I love cooking first of all and my favorite characters is shy Scarlett Cooper Mrs. Simpson and Mr. Crafts so let me just read the first few pages I mean one page for you so that you guys can get along with the story chapter one the worst day of the week the kitchen bottle farts and the last rigs splatter onto my sister's toast my stomach twists but to be honest I was already feeling sick it's Friday morning 7 50 past 7 a.m. 10 minutes to go is there any more Scarlet? Kelsey wipes her chin with the sleeve of her school shirt, leaving a sticky red streak on the cuff. No, I say, we're all out and mum forgot to order more, but you've got enough. I point to the lake of goop that's already smeared all over the toast on top of the butter. Disgusting, Kelsey's almost seven, but she still eats everything with ketchup. So, Kelsey is the little sister. She's almost seven, as my last few words said that. And Shy Scarlet is 18. It doesn't really tell her age, but it says she's almost 18. 18 age up. Yeah, so Scarlet um, lived in a neighborhood next to Mrs. Simpson's house. Mrs. Simpson's lights were always off and they shared a wall but only a door separating it a door so no one goes cross 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 in everybody's houses so they were literally like in the same house but just a wall separating their house which is basically the same house because there are walls in your house which is like the same thing then but only a door separating their house mrs simpson loved to cook she was very good at it I'd give her a 99 thumbs out. Thumbs up out of 10, even though it's more than that number. But I recommend she's very good. Mrs. Simpson was actually their neighbor. And one day, Scarlett found out that Mrs. Simpson had a lovely kitchen. Mrs. Simpson wasn't there. She was in hospital because she had a big fall. But people said it's a little one, but it was a huge one. She came back in a few days. But before she came back, Scarlett used that kitchen as her cooking place. Scarlett really loved it. It was a chef's kitchen. It had to be a chef's kitchen. Wow. Mr. Simpson never cooked. But they could always smell smells. Mrs. Simpson was like a fairy godmother. She could tell how much scoops of baking powder you put. For example, if you bake cupcakes, she'll say, you did this. He even knows who did it. You put two scoops, but there's one scoop. She, she can tell that's how good she's at baking. But Mrs. Simpson always had her lights off and was very sad and anxious that's because two years ago her daughter Marianne died and that was very awkward a mother overliving her daughter like she's older the daughter's at this age and her mother's at this age then this one grows the mother also grows then chukum, dead but the mother is like very high but still alive that's actually very awkward Marianne was was one of the world's most favorite chefs world's most best chefs that's why it makes me think that this mrs. Simpson is definitely Mary Berry well they call her Mary Berry but I don't think Berry is her surname yeah so to find out more about this book make sure you subscribe Buy it or borrow it from a library or anywhere you could find books.
subscribe, hit the thumbs up, hit the post notification bell and always comment down below when I should do my next video. And it does not have to be a book review. Bye!